somewhere along the line we're gonna have to start looking at our MIDI guitar as MIDI controllers and not perhaps guitars per se with a set uh, place for the note C and the, it outputting just the note C in relation to that. I've tuned the output in this video to a special chord and I'm only playing sort of the place for the white keys representations on the guitar but you won't have a C major output. In fact, I've automated a, a movable root note moving on a timeline that is looped beneath my playing. So it sounds something like this. to think about the actual harmony moving and this is also in 7 8 at the same time as it is non-functional harmony it would have been a lot to take on even if it's absolutely doable but for practicing purposes this is a perfect uh, sort of tool for me to work with and especially so as I can play chords containing the minor second interval as well things I wouldn't be able to do if I were playing the MIDI Guitar 2 software standardly. So again, it's a practice device for me, so I can use complex figures and, and patterns and stuff like that. So I can be working in 4-4 if I want to over this 7-8 pattern, and it doesn't matter because the harmony will change beneath it. <laughs> output to some set and automating that output having that moving underneath of what you're playing this is what I'm showing you in this clip this is an improvisation piece it's a trio ECM style something much pleasure I'll see you later bye